Hey, make sure you join the Discord. The link can be found down below in the description. And on YouTube, in today's video, I'm going to be talking about one of the best auto rifles. This auto rifle is actually finally back. This is one of the best 450 RPM auto rifles in Destiny 2. I'm going to be 100% honest with you guys. You need to get this thing before it's too late. At the end of today's video, I will be going over a full God World guide, what you guys want to get, enhanced, and so on. Guys, I would like to say this auto rifle is insane. It's very, very good in PvP, so don't miss out on it. The role we're rocking in today's gameplay is full bore, ricochet, overflow, target lock. What's so special about this auto rifle? It's just another 450 auto rifle. Well, the origin trait. This weapon is granted faster aim down sight speed and movement speed while aiming down sights when no allies are near. This is amazing in things like rumble, trials, not so much control, but it's really, really good. This thing has little to no recoil and very strong range. In the gameplay you guys are watching today, I will be using Prismatic Hunter, unfortunately. Uh, and then we're going to be using a exotic cloak with Spirit of Ophidians. See you guys in the gameplay. Wolf. This thing is so nice. Let's push out here. Has no recoil. Kills relatively fast. Oh, well, we just got picked by a thorn. That's unfortunate. Hopefully my teammates can clutch this round up. Looks like they got this one in the bag. Yep. All right. That's perfect. Yeah, I think the one thing too with Vertech Werewolf to keep in mind is the recoil pattern is very, very light. Like I'm so used to having to pull down the trigger and the thumbstick at the same time or the most, depending on what you guys play on. But like, it's just so weird. This thing has no recoil. It's really weird, honestly. Let's push up here. That guy's weak. Let's uh, double grenade here. Play our life for a minute. We can probably push this angle. Looks like there's somebody right here. Yeah, perfect. There we go. Quick little easy pick. Yeah, these guys are definitely not like the greatest players, but I think... While we wait to get into the next round, I would like to say we have a sponsor today. Today's video is sponsored by Diving.net. Check it out. Guardians, I would like to recommend you a fantastic service. Diving.net, you can find teams to complete different activities like raids, dungeons, trials of Osiris, exotic farming, and many more endgame activities. The best part about the service is it does not require you to share your account information whatsoever. You don't need to give your login or password to order service that you like. All you have to do is select the self play option. To do this, select something you like. In this case, I'll do pro design. You're going to choose your clear option. I'll be doing the full clear, so click full clear. Then select the self play option. As you can see right now, we have $25. To get a discount, make sure you type in code hectic for a 15% discount here. As we can see right now, our total is $25.05. If we apply this coupon, we get $24, so you save a dollar. I would highly advise doing this. From here, you're going to choose a payment method. There's Visa, PayPal, and a few other payment options. In this case, we'll be using Visa. From here, agree to the terms and services, and then proceed to checkout. I would highly recommend naming.net, especially because the funnel shape is releasing and there's many awesome services that can be done. That's all for today, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Scopes that a lot of the guns have in this game. I think it's the only gun that actually has this kind of scope. That's not a remodel, to be honest. I wish this thing could get high ground. That would be insane, but... I'm not sure what this guy's doing. We got overflow too, so we get a lot of bullets. Like, we have 68 bullets in the mag right now, so that's insane. I mean, I have my thumb off the thumbstick, and that's the recoil, right? It's it's pretty crazy. I think on this map, ideally, too, it works really well because it's just kind of, like, close range, you know? Mediocre, medi medium range, like, gunfights that you don't need a crazy amount of range for. Oh, well, this guy's running outside. We picked up special, so we have overflow, and our teammates wrapped up the round. We have some pretty good teammates. Definitely not a fair team balance. I think they put, like, three of the lowest KD players against us and then put all the high KD players on my team, but that usually does not happen, to be honest with you guys. So, I mean, I'm not complaining. Long live that. Oh, we're getting shot at from the other side here on the little windmill area. Teammate got picked by the thorn here. Dude has a really good thorn shot. Let's play our life, though. Quick little melee cleanup. We don't have shotgun ammo anymore, so we're going to have to be careful taking gunfights. 
better close range okay teammate got that kill there we go perfect well that was a very fast and easy game let's go on to the next one specifically like the spot you want to be at with this auto is like probably no more than 30 meters i think that's when drop off starts to happen got a crack on that guy he's really weak and he just slides me the fusion lots of skill guys but our teammates cleaned that up good job we can uh probably rely on our teammates here they look pretty decent I think I think he's moving towards my res. Yeah, he is. Oh no, he decided to change his mind here. Okay. Okay, okay. My teammates are pretty good with it. I'm not sure if this video is me getting carried by my teammates or me uh, showing you guys this auto. Nice little team shot. Good stuff, teammates. That was big. I actually really like this auto too. The design of it is very nice. Like there's no gun that has the same aesthetic design. Very unique. This thing is only like around literally like once every 365 days. So very painful. There we go. 48 to the head with target lock. I think I just hit. So kind of hard to see. But that guy's weak. Let's throw a grenade. We can sit back. There we go. Push up. This guy probably has a shotgun. No, we get a fusion. I think a lot of boat like trials is just playing with their teammates, playing smart, you know, using your brain, using your guns at the appropriate time and such. This will definitely help you. Um, this could be like a video dedicated to like coaching you guys a little bit too on how to win. But I mean, yeah. Range wise, it's pretty nice. Has some really solid range. Like, I mean, we're hitting people from across the map. This is like pulse rifle range. Will you guys have gotten a pulse rifle from this range? Definitely not. Um, unless they miss the two bursts. If they miss the two bursts, you definitely can if you have target lock. Though you relatively can't have overflow like I do because overflow is kind of counterintuitive to that, unfortunately. So yeah, that's that's that. That kind of sucks. If only target lock was pre-nerf target lock. They should have just did that on SMGs only. Such a dumb change. Definitely don't ever try and peek pulses. Uh, like, medium range. Because you... Oh my gosh. I don't know what I just witnessed, to be honest. My teammates are actually saving me. I've had some pretty decent matchmaking so far. No, like, crazy unbalanced lobbies. Though I'm sure I just jinxed it when I said that. So, yeah. We definitely need to get like a intense game in here just to kind of show you guys you know the true glory of this thing i think these guys are honestly just sitting in the spawn maybe now i think they gave up i think this guy's still trying okay and i get mapped by a fusion cool um yeah that's that let's try another match i think this will probably be like the safe game here last game we play with this thing I think this guy's going in with a shotgun, maybe. There we go. Quick little body of the slug. This guy's outside here. He has a Jotun on. Wow. This is just not even funny, to be honest. This thing is so nice. Um, by the way, the way this thing's obtained, I kind of forgot to mention. It's obtained through Airy Ingrams. Weird way to be obtained. You have to spend a thousand candy and then buy them with Airy Ingrams. Pain, but it's definitely worth the grind considering you're not going to be able to get this thing. And it actually just returned, like, after so long. So definitely don't want to miss out on it. Oh, I really risk that, to be honest. If only I had Icarus Grip on. I don't think I have Icarus on right now. Okay, there's no way that Yoden just killed me. That's crazy. I... I guess jumping and strafing doesn't break the tracking. Interesting. Looks like our teammates are pretty solid here. He's gilded times 11. Jumping up. Oh, he also died to the Jotun. Yep. Yeah. Alright, guys. Jotun is the new best gun in the game. Use it now. New Hectic E2 video idea. Because that's, that's, that's brutal, honestly. Jotun might be... That, that guy might be on, like, the Jotun tech. Do you guys use the toaster? Let me know down below in the comments. Me, personally, never... I might have to though, because that's that looks pretty crazy. Here we go. I hear the Jotun pre-firing, so I'm gonna wait. 
Look at that range, man. That range is phenomenal for a 450. That has more range than the Prosecutor and the Omic combined. Okay, definitely not combined, but... I think, too, like, when you pair it with the class item that gives you Spirit of Ophidians, it's very noticeable, because it has relatively low handling, and weird stability, like, low stability, but it doesn't feel like you need stability. Like, I feel like this is the gun that you could have zero stability on and hit every shot with, because it just has no recoil. That guy's weak. Hoping he runs through this, the Jotun. Man, I feel bad, honestly. This isn't even fair. Oh, dude, that's unfortunate. I honestly thought he was going to slide me there. That was a silly play on my side and his side, to be honest. Teammates tried to wrap it up there. Good try, though. That was that was just straight up painful, I'm going to be honest, to watch. That that was bad. Hello Kitty Fanatic and Fat Kid Adept. Interesting names. There's a Jotun on my left here. I'm gonna assume I'm gonna push through the left here because I think he just uses Yoden shots, so he can't do too much. Yeah, he's gonna run. Pulse rifles definitely hurting. Oh my gosh, dude! I don't understand how I didn't kill him there. He has the Sacred Provenance. That's a interesting pulse. I think it's at 340 or 324. Teammates jumping up here. There we go. All right, all right. I think he wins us, right? Surely. No, I think he's playing my eyes. Good play, good play, good play. Hopefully he gets it in time. Okay, he did. Okay, they got all three players up here. The Jotun guys up top. And, bro, there is no way that Jotun just killed me like like that. I swear, man. That thing has aimbot. It, it, it's got to be legal aimbot. There's no way that the Bungie's not like trolling me now. That is honestly insane. Good play for him to jump up like that. I would not expect that. We are down though, so we got to bring this one back here. Yoten guys in the back. Not today, buddy. We must have target lock rocked. There we go. Body that guy. Nice. And there we go. Yeah. 32 to the head from like 30 meters is honestly ideal for any auto rifle. You're going to oak on pulses if they don't hit a two burst. So to ensure they don't, definitely try and throw on something like high caliber rounds to flinch them a lot. Because you will need that. Sucks, but I mean, you kind of have no choice if you're trying to run off meta things. Pair with like a Zealot's Reward and you're set. You literally never lose a match. Smoke Bomb there. Except it was really off. Oh, we're weak. Let's play our life here. The Yoten guy's probably going to be on the right. We got a grenade. He's weak. Teammate killed one, but also died. Good pick, teammate. That was big. There we go. I honestly thought that guy was going to condition on me there. Alright, we brought this match back. It's 4-3 now, so hopefully we can end it off. We're, like, almost to our divider, so that kind of works for us. These guys both have Day 1 Vesper of House Dungeon Cleaves. I still gotta do that dungeon, actually. I wanna make a video on the dungeon auto rifle. Somebody's alone outside here, and it's the young guy. Get away from me. Get away from me. What the heck is this guy doing, bro? Yo, honestly, this guy just straight up outplayed me. I can't I can't even be mad. Honestly, he, he actually just outplayed me, bro. There's literally no reason right now for me to be mad about that. We might actually go 4-4 right now. I'm hoping my teammates clutch this up, but this game really does not need to be this close. Alright, yeah. This is really bad. Let's uh, end this game before we lose, because that would be really bad to lose a game that we definitely should be winning right now. Let's run inside here. Two of these guys are going inside. The Jotun guy is probably going to stay. No, they're actually playing together here. Hopefully our teammate uses his brain and throws his tether in there. That's the Jotun guy down. This guy's probably going to try and slide me, yeah. Uh... Please use your tether teammate. There you go, buddy. Oh, collateral diffusion. What a way to end it. Yeah. All right, let's get on to what you guys want to use for rolls on this thing. So for Braytech Werewolf, honestly, there's not a lot of perk options. However, yeah. Let's talk about one. Uh, you guys can get for your barrel. You're definitely going to want to go with something like Hammerforge Rifling for the 10 range. 
Ricochet for the stability and range. Dynamic Sway. And then probably Kill Clip, Target Lock, or Gunshot Straight. Not sure why Target Lock's not coming up here. D2 Foundry might have not updated it. But yeah, we throw on a range Masterwork and then a Ballistics. You guys are going to have 100 range and 57 stability. Yeah, this is what you guys want to craft ideally. But yeah. Uh, that's all for today's video. Have a great night. Peace. Thanks for watching. You're like.